Does this top the McDonald's burger? That's tough. You better come here hungry. That's why I'm taking some points away. Is it edible? I don't know why it's called bushwhackers. Yet. I don't know. <laughs> Out of a hundred. You're gonna have to come back to me on the points. Uh, bonjour now. Here we are at Bushwhackers, which is somewhere to the northwest we're going to do this with the obviously with the timing. We're going to do it with the taste. Obviously, that's the most important part. Uh, edibility. How dirty is it? Presentation. <laughs> Presentation. And then obviously value for money. We've just placed our order. This is exciting stuff, guys. <laughs> <laughs> right in the bush here. Pretty cool little place. It's called Rus Lancia. Uh, common worry dish. And it's very significant because it's always got trifoliate leaves. Always. Okay. That's how you can tell straight away and the bark. <laughs> yeah! <laughs> that looks pretty good. Spot on. Thank you very much. Wow. It's delicious. Oh, that's a pepper steak. Yeah. No? No, a pepper sauce. Pepper burger. sauce. Yeah. Presentation is spot on. It's got, it's got height, it's got juiciness. Very nice. Timing was half an hour exactly from ordering to getting served. That's not bad. It's kind of relieved. Yeah. Sides are. And we are going in. Good chips. Onion rings are good, a little bit doughy, but they've got some kind of a spice on them. Chips are on point. There we go, going in. <laughs> oh my word. Wow, dude. <laughs> It's dirty. <laughs> it tastes good. Pepper, sauce. Definitely worth the wait to get to this point. So this is my first burger here ever. I've been here before, but this is my first burger here. It's, it's, it's a sturdy burger. It's held together. It's got height. It's amazing. <laughs> I love this burger. I had it before. We'll always get it. Say no more. <laughs> it looks high and homemade. Out of a hundred. Yeah, 95. 95? Yeah, I love this burger. I agree with uh, my dude on the plain grill. I think it would be nice for the plain grill. I don't know how they cooked it, but it was very juicy. Good points. Ooh. I don't know, you're going to have to come back to me on the points. I need to think about this one. Jerry's on the fence. What about you, sir? I think in the late 70s. I think the patty is really good now. It's really, really good. I think the sides are fantastic. But there's one or two critical points specifically with cheeseburger and how you place the cheese and how you grill the cheese on the burger and then present it. So okay. that's where I'm taking some points away. 78, 78. 95. Oh, I love this burger. I'm going to give it 82. Because originality, the handmade patty, which is very good. Uh, onion rings, maybe not so good. If you like this, it's great. <laughs> Very good. 88. 88. It's going to be a hard one to top, guys. Does this top the McDonald's burger? Yes. We don't know yet. <laughs> right, here's the damage, guys. We're looking for value for money as well. I think it's on point. This is a roughly exactly what you expect to pay for a burger. Service was good. Uh, the sides were okay. Burger was handmade. Very cool. So now we're going on to the next one. Thanks for watching this one.